Hey guys, how you guys doing? It's Arnie back with another video and today we're gonna take a look at the Zero Pack event. The Zero to 100 event over here by Spigelman, everybody. So what is this event about? This is a basically a grinding meal event. All players that start off as a brand new character uh, they wanted to go into level 100 but they don't know what to do, right? They don't know which map to grind. Don't worry. This is the event for you. You can basically assign uh, set up to seven characters throughout the entire event. It's only once per day, but seven characters, which is absolutely amazing over here. All right. So they will basically give you all these areas over here. And you just, when you reach that level, the monsters will no longer spawn. You will basically go into the map directly. We're going to show you over here, everybody. All right, so we're going to grind a brand new character. This is a mega burning character. Mega burning character means that you will be able to get one plus two levels up to level 130. Uh, for GMS, it's 150 levels over there. So we're going to type in over here, confirm. All right, and we're going to go. There we go. All right, so we're going to start off over here. It's a dungeon okay uh you share with uh other players in this map but the exp here is insane the monsters you get the monsters on your own okay so don't worry it's an instance map uh, no see oh my god the levels god damn you god damn you that is insane man okay i'm gonna go through uh level 10 to level 100 in this video okay and i'm gonna guide you through how to make a Mew over here, okay? So this is basically a beginner's guide on the new age leveling for Mews, for your legions, for your unions, and uh, everything. Okay, so I forgot to use my double EXP over here. So that is that is uh, something that you need to take note. You can use double EXP as well. So once you get all the double EXP MVP up, Ah, that is the EXP. So without double EXP and MVP, you can still basically get insane amount of EXP. And they give you items as well, as you can see, right? So you, you don't need equips at all. They give you all the equipments, right? You can uh, open uh, the potential for it and you can get all of it over here for free. Yeah, for free, everybody. So basically, it's basically three levels. So level 60, you need to get to level 60 to get the equip. Now, I'm gonna go through the next map. Click on it, you go to the next map over here, all right? I oh, need to uh, up my skills over here. Wait. And apparently you do not need job advancement unless you don't have enough damage to one hit, uh, then you need job advancement over here. But yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay at this until level 100. <laughs> See the difference uh, from uh, with double EXP and without double EXP over here. Even without double EXP just now, the EXP is absolutely insane, okay? So I, I need to stress that because a lot of people are gonna be like, Oh, you're grinding so fast, but uh, it's because you're having all the boosters and everything. One thing is yes, but another thing is... Uh, I can sh I just show you that you don't need to, okay? Uh, there's no equipments that I have. It's basically all the equipments that they give, okay? Just to take note. And uh, this is a stat that I have over here. Best grinding event. Okay, now we want to move on to another map over here, okay? I forgot to move as well. <laughs> Leveling too fast, everybody. You see? Absolutely amazing. All the mobs are instant, all right? Even if you see someone in the map, they have their own mobs, the mob skills according to your level over here. It's just basically three levels. There we go. Ah, no mobs already. Uh, okay, there we go. Okay. Three levels. Three levels. Seven characters per event over here. Absolutely amazing. Okay, we're level 70. Moving on to the next map over here. And if you don't redeem the, the equipment, when you click on uh, the next map, they will ask you to redeem the equipment as well. Okay? So these are the equips that they gave, right? Actually, you don't really need to... Uh, for me, I don't really need to do uh, to uh, open the potential, but I mean, for you, you might want to open it. If you do not have enough damage to one hit. But most of it, you can basically one hit over here. Wow! Absolutely amazing. Woohoo! God damn you. Oh, a cannon shooter over here is just absolutely amazing. 
Yeah, I am left with cannon shooter. That is the that's the only meal that I have not had for Legion or Union. So that's why I'm creating it. I'm not making this as a bossing meal. I'm just making it as a Legion meal over here. I'm gonna get it to 200, and I'm gonna show you guys how to get to 200 in this video as well. All right. So we're gonna get everything done in this video. I'm not gonna cut it out. Uh, maybe I'm gonna cut out the uh, job advancement part, but we'll see, we'll see. Just to let you guys know, like, how to get to the level 200 in new age, everybody. Okay, 90. Okay, moving on to the next map over here. Alright. Okay. So, this is a flat map. If your character can rush through the entire map, then this is, like, legitly the best map for you already. Some of the characters that we need to jump up or up jump might go into the platform. It's a little bit difficult, but still good. The EXP is absolutely amazing, man. And you have summons or anything. Wow, this map is just absolutely amazing. Okay, so you can basically get up to 101 level and then they will kick you out already. They will not spawn any monsters. But for a burning character, yeah, that's basically it. So I already get to 101 over here. All right, and uh, the job of one spoon and everything. God damn it. Okay, so that's basically it for the zero pack. And you also get a uh, level 100 equipment box over here. Okay, so you don't need to worry about your equipments are not having enough or you're not prepped for it. You do need to prep for some of the accessories, but yeah, you just equip this one over here. All right. Oh, oh, I forgot to, uh, potential this guy. Okay, good shit. Alright, now we're gonna do some job advancement over here, everybody. Okay, I've completed my job advancement. Apparently, I put all the skill points in this one. But it's fine. We can level up in a bit, right? Don't worry about that too much. Okay, so... Main thing first, you gotta accept the identistic event over here because this event gives out a shit ton of EXP as well as the stats that you can get over here, alright? So, we're gonna just accept all the quests over here and make sure we uh, get all the events. And if you have a guild, join a guild as well because that is actually very important. Um, we're gonna join a guild in a bit as well, okay? Okay, so we are all ready, okay? I actually applied for a guild. I don't think we need it at this point of time. But, uh, accepting the quest will unlock your temp stats, right? So these are your temp stats over here, and also you can unlock the rewards over here. So how are we gonna level up over here is that... Alright, so, as you can see that there is a uh, Trats Potion over here, right? You can redeem this Trats Potion over here to basically level up your charm and uh, get your pocket to level 30 over there okay so once you once you unlock it you see your pocket unlocked you can basically equip this over here once you reach level 140 the pink bean one is the best okay if you have, don't have a good flame the green color text over there the, the stat doesn't matter just equip it right now then uh from this npc over here right there are two npcs over here the shop so this is the boss shop Okay, where you need to kill weekly bosses, and this is the regular shop, alright? So regular shop, you'll be able to get this VIP ticket over here. The VIP ticket over here, you can choose between EXP or boss uh, buff over here. So I'm gonna choose EXP over here, okay? Now, what we need to do is, we need to find a rune, alright? Okay, so we got a rune over here already. Now, let's go into this over here. The Identistic Adventure over here. So this one, once you are level 100 all the way, 101 all the way to uh, 260, you will be able to enter into this map. It's like the Strawberry Farm. The EXP over here is absolutely amazing. Look at the EXP. There are 1,000 mobs over here, okay? You can do it on any characters that is between uh, 101 to uh, 260, okay? And if you if you basically want to exit the map, you can come back and continue up to you as well. That is fine. So we're gonna up our skills over here as well, and uh, we need the summons because more mobs, more mobs, more summons. We gotta kill all of them over here, everybody. All right, moving on with all the summons. We gotta get our. <gasps> no, I crashed. 
Okay, so now we found a rune again, everybody. Oh my god. God damn, it's so difficult to find a rune here. Okay, let's use this rune. Get into back into the map. Let's uh hope that we don't DC over here. Alright, it is time everybody. Let's go. Okay, we're continuing back over here on the mobs. Okay, we're gonna summon this over here, summon this over here. Okay, my uh, burning is already ended, so I'm just gonna get one level. But you can see that the amount of EXP over here is just absolutely insane, man. God damn, this is why you need the rune over here. So, yeah, as I mentioned before, you can get out of the map if you think that, oh, your rune has already ended all just not like me unfortunately i disconnected from the game so i can actually get out wait for another rune again and come back so yeah that's how it works okay i got 500 mobs left over here about 600 good exp everybody and there's some bosses that spawn over there the giant mobs that gives a shit ton of exp right so that actually spawns at like uh, the last one that spawns at like the less than I think it's like around zero, then you will spawn another one over there, which is actually really, really good EXP. Alright, so we gotta. Oh my god, the, the, the levels over here couldn't catch up, everybody. Look at how insane it is. Grinding your muse is just like a, a breeze, my guy. Damn. Now look at that. Damn, they're gonna spawn another boss over there. Da da. What does this dude do over here? Oh, is this an explosion or something? Okay. <laughs> do not know what does that skill do, but okay. Okay, 151 over here, 52. Okay, wow, well, we are almost uh we are almost done. We got 200 more like, mobs left. Yeah, having summons in this map is just absolutely amazing because you can actually kill the mobs left, right, and center, everybody. Hell yeah. Okay, moving down over here. Ah, we got another one over here again. 154. Uh, this is without burning, everybody. Imagine we're burning, we, uh, we'll be uh, at like 180 or some shit already. <laughs> we could be already done. Damn. Okay, 100 mobs left over here. Okay. Good EXP. I think we could get to like 160, I guess. Okay, in less than two minutes. God, this is insane, man. Oh, damn. Okay. Six more, and there's gonna be a boss spawning when it reaches zero. There we go. Bam! Wow, 160. Cool, so. Okay, so once you get that done, um, you can't go in anymore. It's three per week only. So that's basically it. I'm gonna get back into town. Now we're gonna use uh, the potion strat over here. So. I got like two boing potions over here from um, the daily gift. So I'm gonna use the two boing potions over here first. One. Oh, I got 10 levels. Oh, two, oh. Okay, I got four levels over here. Now, we're gonna use the identistic event uh, over here. This is the attendance. So every day when you are logging, you click on one button, you get the attendance. So that's basically it. And you'll be able to get a stamp. Now I'm gonna use 10 over here. It gives a shit ton over here. 10, uh, 10, 10, 10, 10. My god, that's a lot, my guy. Alright, so these are all the all the growth over here, but these are all the potions over here, alright? So Woo! Eight levels, my man! Two levels, ah. Uh, one level? Oh come on, man. Come on, give me more. One level? Ah shit. One Oh my god, I used all my luck on the 10 over there. God damn, I'm getting one level. Oh, five levels are two or so. Two levels, very nice. Two levels, very nice. And one level. Okay, we gotta need one more over here, everybody. So, uh, two more levels over here. Okay, good shit. I'm gonna use out this potion over here as well. Okay, give me, give me two levels. Give me two levels. Ah, ah one level. Okay, never mind. Okay, we done. So we have successfully got our Mew over here to a level 200, everybody. So that is basically how you level up for free. 
Okay, and of course, if you don't want to use all the potions or you do not have enough potions, you can just do the uh, event. Oh, um, just now the one that I went in, the adventure over there is three per week. So you can just do that. It's free EXP, everybody. All right, so I need to do fifth job advancement over here. All right, and uh, that's basically it. Okay, so I hope you guys get some insights on how to basically level up over here as a brand new character. Woo, my union. Absolutely amazing. The brand new character over here, all the way up to 200 with the breeze. All right, just by completing events and uh, going on, uh, find the damn rune, okay? And you're basically done, everybody. In less than, I don't know how long is this, uh, probably less than uh, 10 minutes, you'll be done everything already. All right. That's basically it. Thank you very much for tuning into this video. Hope you guys get some insights of the Maple Story New Age 0 to 100 event plus the identistic uh, event over here, everybody. Alright, as always, leave that subscribe. Stay awesome, everybody. Stay safe. Bye bye.